Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Tommy Podcast, where I believe a healthy life starts with a healthy mind. If you're on the quest to improve your sleep quality, boost your positivity, and end your day with peacefulness, you are in the right place. So, what's the mindset today? Having a positive mindset can make a big difference when things seem tough. You know, we all go through times when nothing feels right. And it seems like giving up is the easiest option. I don't know if you can relate, but I've experienced this feeling when my relationship sucks, when my business hits a low, and when my health isn't at its best. It's tempting to just throw in the towel. What I've learned is to avoid making big decisions when I'm feeling down. It's okay to feel negative sometimes, but it's important to not act impulsively. Instead, think about the good times with your loved ones and the lessons learned from the past challenges. Be thankful for these things. I think it's very important to practice gratitude every single day, even on days we don't feel like doing anything. And that is my morning routine. Every morning before starting my day, I take a moment to sit calmly at my desk and note down at least one thing I'm grateful for. Today, it was a cup of coffee and a peaceful piano playing in the background, the support and love from people around me when I'm in difficulties. When we try to look for the good in everything that we do, no matter how small it is, life will turn out to be easier for us. Even in our darkest times, when facing difficulties, practice asking yourself, "What can I be grateful for in this?" It could be support from friends and family, a lesson learned from a tough situation, or strength and resilience that have brought you this far. See, you have a lot to be grateful for. For sure, it is easier said than done. It requires a lot of practice and effort, but it's worth it. I promise. The real experience I want to share with you is about my business. This year, as many businesses face challenges. Mine is no exception, but instead of complaining about the economy or the people, I practice looking at the bright side of this situation. I perceive this as an opportunity, a chance to step back, prepare, and reorganize for a better future. This slower period allowed me to start my new podcast, practice journaling, and spend more time with my loved ones. I focused more on my mental and physical health, things I couldn't prioritize during busier times. Embracing this mindset brings relief to my life a lot. I hope this connects with your situation. During tough times, ask yourself, "What can I be grateful for? What's good about this situation?" And keep in mind, life won't always be easy. If everything seems perfect. You might be going downhill. Challenges and difficulties are there to make you stronger. Even when you're at the top, you may need to come down a little bit to conquer the next challenge. That is life, and that is the end of today's episode. If you enjoy the journey today, please hit the follow button on the platform you're listening on. I can't wait to catch you in the next one. Until then. 